So in this session, I am going to implement the logout and also the can activate card. Let's get started. So first, I am going to implement a logout button and the functionality inside the home component. So I'm not adding any styles right now. I'm simply adding a logout button. So having sign out and on click, I'm calling a function, a logout. And in the TS file, I'm going to implement a function, which is logout. On login time, you can see I'm adding a session storage. So I'm going to clear the session storage here. So since I'm only having one variable in the session storage, I'm clearing everything, okay? And I'm going to redirect after the logout, we have to redirect from the home page to the login page. For redirection purpose, we have to import, we have to inject the router first. So private router, then I have to import the router from Angular router, okay? So then you can access this dot router this dot router dot navigate and in an array you can mention to which url you have to redirect so after login so after logout it is redirecting to the login so you can see in the inspect element if i type if you want to see the session storage go to the application and you can see here session storage so i am typing the mail test1 at gmail.com which i have registered previously and i am adding the password on sign in that session storage have an email and on sign out the session will be cleared and no data it is redirecting to the login page the next thing is we have to implement a can activate guard why we need a guard okay so now you can see i have log out from this application i am not supposed to access the home page without login if you try the url directly you can see the home page is able to access for me so we have to avoid this so in order to do that for the routes we can implement a guards okay so for that we already created a guard here so initial video i created a card using angular cla and it has this function so if the session storage has the email we will return true else we will navigate to the login page if user trying to access home page without login okay so for that we have to first check session storage get email is there then we'll return true else in order to navigate to login page we have a router so we have to inject router first so router equal to First, you have to uh, import the inject from angular core and we have to import the router from angular router then as i mentioned before in the home.component.ts for logout you have to add router.navigate then the url needs to be added so login if user is trying to access any page other than the login or register we have to redirect to the login page if there is no session available since the auth card only accept a boolean or the url tree you have to return router.navigate save and you have to add this auth card in all the components other than login and register so going to app.routingmodule.ts file we only have one component right home component so now we are adding here can activate then auth card this auth card can activate function need to be imported so if you press the control dot it will ask for the auto import okay so now auth card is done let's see how it works so i have reserved the application again behind the scene i'm trying to access the home page now it is logged out trying to access the home page it is getting redirecting to the login page you can see it is redirecting to the login page and after test one, I'm adding the password after logging in. Now you will be able to see the home page. After sign out, if you try to access the login again, it is redirecting to the login page. 